Tracker's online. Confirming Goldie's on the Dast and Sacro scut. Seatbelts, everyone. We're going in hot. Crap. Hold on. Hold on. Got him! Alpha Hercula system, inside the Keystone Asterism. Got it. Coordinates are in. We're not getting away this time. Down, power down. How the flark are we supposed to fight that? Hell yeah, Nova Core! The world mind must have. Oh, come on. I don't think they're with the world mind anymore. <laughs> Cops flying next to pirates. Merchant vessels, military. Anybody you would have fought back's already here. Playing for the wrong team. Well, can't say we didn't try. Nikki's in there somewhere. There's gotta be a way. Yes, we overpower them with our own vastly superior fleet. Well, regrettably, we do not have one. Guys, we do our best work when we're out of options. Somebody's got to have something. Rocket, anything? Uh, what about the Ravagers? You could ask for a temporary truce. Yondu's rotting away in the kiln, thanks to me. You could bust them out. Jailbreak the kiln. I'd rather take my chances with the church fleet. I'll bust them out. Yeah, I'd bet on Gamora. As would I. I am so would I, but it doesn't matter. The rest of the Ravagers scattered during the war. Any survivors are laying low or serving time in one of a dozen backwater planets. Besides, what's a pirate without a ship? <coughs> Groot, and no bad ideas. I am Groot. Yeah, that's a bad idea. We're not going to the Shatari. That is the kind of wildcard we're looking for, just not that one. The snakes would shoot us in the back. Assuming they don't shoot us in the front. Drax. You have royal blood. Perhaps it is time for the Prince of Spartax to return and rally his people. You been to Spartax lately? I have not. But Spartoi technology is well beyond- Spartax was sacked during the war because of its tech. You can't even land there anymore. <laughs> Hold on. What if the answer's been slobbering right in front of us this entire time? Peter Quill, this, this beast cannot operate a ship. That's, that's not what I'm saying. Think about it. Cammy's pretty much useless to us, but she's also useless to the church. They want people to brainwash. I bet animals aren't even on their radar. They went after Cosmo. Cosmo's mind is way more advanced than ours. His intelligence makes him weak to the promise, just like Rocket. Thanks, but not an animal. What I'm saying is we know someone with an entire beast army, and I bet Raker hasn't even looked twice at her. How can you be certain she is not one of them? I am Groot. Guardians of the Gut! Nope, she's good. You do realize she still wants to flay us and feed us to her babies? Guys, this is it. Okay, our one last long shot. We've got to find a way to apologize and make things right. Okay, well, we'll get her a gift. A peace offering. Groot ain't going back in a cage. No, nope. think bigger. Way bigger. The one beast that she'd want more than any other. Drax knows what I'm talking about. Oh, yes! Oh, no, 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 no. Here it comes! You know where we're going! To Maklufor! To battle the legendary Fin Fang Foom! Totally gonna fly into that, aren't we? They 
We say that the rings of Maku 4 perpetually rain fire down upon the godless abominations that dwell below. How fun. <laughs> I'm sure it's worse than it looks, too. It is. Many of my people braved this same treacherous pilgrimage before me, never to return. That's good. <laughs> it's just, it's perfect. This is us. This is how we park. <laughs> well, this is how Quo parks anyways. <laughs> we were not fated to die this day. Unless, of course, Fin Fang Foom devours us whole. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. we gotta find him first. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, this is insane. This is how we park, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that definitely shouldn't be sparking. We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. And convince Lady Albender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? Flark it. Let's do it. Uh, listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. Follow as I lead the melody. So traju tukluk, peldagor morgath, Soltas Flandergath. Really? We're doing this? Targath Gonot Kol, Volmalki Ultath, Gothan Kol Galmak. Targath Gonot Kol, Volmalki Ultath, Gothan Kol Galmak. Muffin Sarduth, Jut Kainagal Tau, Goth and Kogal Mak. Muffin Sarduth, Jut Kainagal Tau, Goth and Kogal Mak. Gal Mak, Gal Mak, Soltas Flander Gath. What does that last line mean, Drax? Soltat Flander Gath. It means we will be victorious. I knew this day would come. I was destined to battle the Dragon Lord of Kakaranthara. Bet you didn't think you'd be fighting him with this team of a holes. I did not. But I am thankful fate has granted me this honor. 
All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit witches, it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me, or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fing Fang Foom. And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will go for it. Okay, well, I ain't seeing no Foom Foom. You should look for me. The legends of raining fire are true! Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death! Well, as long as it's glorious! Watch out! We did not come here to be slain by ice and rocks. There is only one noble way to die on Mach 4. Like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Drax we ain't come here to die! No one's dying! We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? Uh, maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! Looks like a dead end. Glorious dead end. Gotta admit, I kinda love how excited you are about all this. All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement toward this rock. Ah, I shall pretend as the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great. Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, Galaxy. I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. I am Groot. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. You can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. I think I see something up ahead! Look! My people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories? When Mantis... That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken. Physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foom? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. A truly glorious death. They came here wanting to die, didn't they? Those Katathians believe that in order to reach paradise, Ultath, you must live a life filled with purpose. Failure to achieve this results in banishment to Sarduth. The bad place. It is not a place. It is non-existence. Kind of like what's going to happen to the whole galaxy if the church gets its way. Indeed. Thanos would have loved this planet. Mm. Now bring on fi- <laughs> 
Fight Foom! Okay, so on a scale of 1 to 10, how much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? 10,000. That's what I figured. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right, but 10,000 times will... Drax is the literal one, remember? <gasps> Flark and Hala! Whoa, get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him... Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. Just not sure how. Looks like there might be a ledge hiding under all those rocks on the other side. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right. And what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Incoming! So step two of your plan is crushing us all? I think I see what he's up to. Yeah, crushing us all. Hey, D, lob it. Certainly. Where shall I move it? Let's just say we do catch Fin Fang Foom. We're just gonna drag him all the way back? I'll call the Milano over and we'll hook him up with the tow cables. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we got ourselves a- <laughs> Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? Drax, I know you've been waiting for this a long time. Enjoy it, man. Thank you, Peter Quill. I must admit that with everything that has happened, I need this. Yeah, well, maybe if we'd listened to you from the start and just gone after Foom... Then we'd probably be dead. We so weren't ready before. I was born ready. <laughs> This place has way too many caves and crevices. Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. Great. More foom food to deal with. You want to underestimate anyone who survives the perils of this planet. Good advice. Chop, chop, Gamora! The rest of you should think of this as a warm-up for Fin Fang Foom! We don't have time for warm-ups! Baker's bridge will go up any second! Oh, you cracks! No, they don't look like the worms I used to have! I'll enjoy this! How's everybody holding up? No parking freezing! And the hunt for Fin Fang Fu continues. Okay, let's just think things through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual- Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foo, it will be an honorable final act. I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Let us hope we are not too late. All right, let's figure out a way to get through here. There, see? More ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not. But smart ones do. Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test wood. The adversaries. Oh, it's Lady Hellbender legends all over again. Careful! That's deadly gas. How do you know? So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Foom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Oh, I want full credit for the kill. For the last time.
time, Drax. We're not killing Fin Fang Foom. We're catching him to get the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. <sighs> Seems complicated. Rocket, are you neck deep in water? We're about to stare down a legendary dragon that's made of the entire galaxy of stick. I ain't gonna hold this up. Instead of giving her boom, any chance Lady H might settle for a few of these, whatever they are? I'm thinking no! Didn't think so! Keep your weapons out! It's not over yet! Let's end it! I believe you are right, Peter. You should really go back through. and study them someday. Whoa! You see that thing? Groot, <laughs> <laughs> loving the initiative. <laughs> So trajo to cloak. Ha 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 I think you can anchor to this wall. Seems doable. This is definitely in Drax's wheelhouse. Knock it down, Drax. It shall fall. Who won't know what hit him? You will be more resilient than a boulder, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. We are the perfect team. Meh, we're okay. That's high praise coming from Murder Mom. Whoa! Fucking Maclu! Maclu 4. You must be fair to the Apocalypse. <laughs> this is nothing compared to the legendary teeth and claws of Fin Fang Fu. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if he doesn't live up to all the hype. <laughs> Assuming we live that long. Peter, look! There's smoke ahead. Think it's Foom? More likely it's people. Great. Maybe they'll know where he is. Or they'll attack us on sight. I could probably infiltrate the camp, look for weak links, make an example of the right person, bleed them out in front of their crew. The shock of it will cause confusion or maybe even surrender, and we carve through the rest. Hey, uh... Is everything okay? We didn't really talk after your, um... The killing my sister thing? Yeah, and other tangential topics. I'm fine. Ish. Okay. Peter, there's a good chance Nikki's already lost. No. 
I don't accept that. And if she is, I know I'll be the one expected to make the hard call. She's my daughter. But I'm the killer. We both know that. It's not gonna come to that. And if it does? If it's a choice between her and literally everything else, Peter, you'd do anything for someone you care about. And we both know that I... We both know that you would as well. Which is why you're exactly who I need to bring my girl home. Alive. I hope you're right. Muffins are good. Boom! It's boom! Yes! Oh, I'm going to go in you fucking rock! Yes! I am a yeah, Ominous is right! Hell, muffins are good. Watch out! That's a lot of death this spikes! Is my skin is so resistant! Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. Ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Felt that one too. And that one. <sighs> At least it ain't quite as cold in this cave. I. I'm so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh, yeah. The zipper. Man, I gotta fix that thing. Ugh. What is that? Come on, Rocket. We got past your fear of water. That ain't water. Good thing that rock tried to murder us, or we'd have never got Quill's sweet new power. Maybe we should almost kill you more often? That's not how it works. How do we get across this tunnel? Perhaps we can leap to the ledge above. I wouldn't hold your breath. Oh, of course not. Steady breathing is essential to an effective leap. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltonator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? Petey Hot Guns. No! Captain Fireball. Not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glob. Captain Heat Glob. Nope. No. Fortune smiles upon us this day, my friends. We just almost got crushed by a giant meteor. Indeed. Almost. He's got you there. Flark, it might be his name. Maybe he's trying to communicate. Please don't. Star Lord. See? <laughs> Star Lord. Is he 
it just me, or did he sound a little irritated? Nope, there was definitely hatred in that voice. Ha! <laughs> Always the charmer, Quill. Ch check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Ah! It burns! <laughs> Root says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Those things grow in a frozen hellscape. I think they're made of sturdier stuff than that. Yeah, I think we've earned a vacation. Preferably on a normal planet where nothing's trying to kill us. With nowhere and contracts you're wrecked, all of our favorite drinking holes are gone. The Milano is still intact. Mostly. Yeah, look, Quill, it's your new best bud. I'd say communication has failed. Another up there. Ours, my friends, unless they send reinforcements. If they do, we'll have to move like lightning. Hit them from behind. <laughs> but what if they're too fast? We'll need another plan. Hey, hey, hey! Every battle comes with some kind of curveball. But trying to predict where it's gonna land only makes things worse. Relax. It's easy to overthink when things get tense, but if we focus... We can hit him hard. Who's with me? Today, I, I can't am wait the to take him down! Feel him? String him up, crew! Gamora! Cut that! Sick of Jax! Looks like they've evolved to survive these conditions! Their hide shall make an excellent coat! Here's your chance, Gamora! Why can't we ever just meet a nice local? Perhaps they are more amenable to the way, Drax. Head on a swivel! Drax! Kick their foot! Yeah. Yeah. Ah! A good fight warms the blood! Still don't know how you do this shirtless! No wonder they're grumpy! On this hunk of ice. Are you kidding? This is me before coffee. He is weakened. Attack! Finally, let me at him. Push down for start. Find it. Go home. <laughs> Get it? I don't think they're listening. Get the boy. Why can't we ever just meet a nice local? We do tend to attract a certain sort! Yes! I am enjoying myself! Time's up! No doubt these beasts serve as sustenance for food! As long as we ate what feeds them! Chop them up! Okay, I'm done playing with the snow monkeys. Wendigo. Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling Wendigo. Wendigo. See? Sounds like we haven't seen the last of them. Maybe Hellbender will want to add some of those Wendigo to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge. Hey, they started it. Wendigo. Wendigo. Into their zoo? Looks more like a dinner plate. Well, let's make sure we 
don't end up on the menu. You will, Wilco! I think that's going into the light this time! One last gross flaily thing! That thing was freaking nasty! Incoming attack! Watch it, Drax! This is a bad tactical position! We were kind of in a hurry! Right in the face! Thing! Their visage invites punching! That wreck is the camp we saw? Nah, uh, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side of it. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. Oh, please. It's probably the least dangerous thing on this planet. All right, Groot, give me a boost. About yay high. Yay is not the unit measurement. Groot knows what he means. I'm gonna drop something down for you guys. I never truly believed this day would come. Look out below! Ha! 
That'll work. You think those creatures were using this ship for shelter? Screw them. They're dead. Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke. Any more hostiles. Maybe it's just a nice warm fire and some cigar and spirits. Ooh, maybe it's a barbecue. What's barbecue? What? You guys have never had barbecue? Charbroiled burgers, grilled steaks, baby back ribs? Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Is all this foom? Undoubtedly. Up ahead. Looks like there's a survivor. Who goes there? No head. She has no head. I believe that repulsive tentacle orb is her head. And I can hear you with it. Are you the only survivor? Clearly not. Who are you, Meat Sacks? We're here for foom. Forget what I said. Yeah, I'm the only survivor. Or will be. I take it you know where we can find him? Sure. Digesting my men back at his roost. Big Eyes Obelisk sticking out of the Caldera's frozen sea. Don't worry, we'll take care of Foom. Sure you will, Terran. Just don't come running back here when he chases you. Still got some things to pack up. Sorry about your men. Meh, dead men collect no paychecks. May as well put it to good use, right? They ain't using it. Ding, ding, done. Here's hoping we do better against Foom than this lot. Big ice thingy on the frozen sea, eh? I think. You said it, buddy. Sure is a long way down. Another hunt marker? This one is unclaimed. No doubt it belonged to one of these corpses. Guess they never got the chance to plan it. I've appropriated it for our own use. To herald our bravery this day. Shall mark our ultimate conquest, or our glorious defeat. Who may be bad news, but he's nothing compared to the fight that comes next. It shall mark our penultimate conquest. One conquest at a time. All right, people. Let's catch us a dragon. Yes. We grow ever closer to our great destiny. You're awful, Chipper, considering Foom obliterated that camp like it was nothing. We are not nothing. I'm with Drax. No mountain too high, no valley too low. Literally. Whoa! Take heed! The ice is amplifying our velocity! This is how I die! takes care of the getting down part. I don't even want to think about how we're going to get back up. Or how we're going to get Foom up there. But on the bright side, we may be dead. Nonsense. We shall be victorious and our conquest will fill us with the vigor of ten. Back on Earth, people would use dog sleds. A whole line of huskies pulling a sled across the ice. Don't expect me to be the dog. I was actually thinking of the Wendigo. And Foom is the sled. That's the Craziest idea I've ever heard. Yeah. I love it. You I'm getting too old for this. How old are you? Old enough. You won't say that old? No, that young. I was grown, remember? I ain't gonna brand myself with how many cycles I've been sucking down air. Ooh, 
I didn't think it could get any colder. You know, it's days like these I'm glad I installed seat warmers in the Milano. Up ahead, there's the ice obelisk. This must be it, the frozen sea. This is the perfect spot. Here we will challenge the great beast. Fin Fai Foom! Come and face your death! What are you doing? We can't get the drop on him if he knows we're here. Also, we're not killing him, remember? Shout with me. Here we demonstrate our metal. Fin Fang Foom! Your end draws near! Nope, not his end. The Quill, go! Uh, fin Fang Foom, it's nap time! <laughs> Rocket, it's your turn! Did he just say my real name? Rocket! Fin Fang Foom, we're gonna decomboggle your flocked scut spigots! You hear me? He hears you! You scaly, overgrown gordel splode! You fessed lump of Satarki and shrub meat! You don't scare us! It feels good, does it not? Yeah! Yeah! It actually does! No! We just roll! Yeah, we're not doing that. Just through here. Be ready for anything. That is technically impossible. We spooked him. Impossible. Foom was born without fear. You don't know that. In the cold heart of a dying star. The dying stars ain't cold. This one was. You think his lair's behind that? Let's find out. Rain of 
happy to warm you up! You don't stand a chance! Watch out for him! Well, everything! Beast grows frantic! Our victory is at hand! Bob's away, but feel free to give up, Bob! Triumphant! Who must fall it? Queen of Seknarf 9, you said you'd hear him out! 
promised. Speak. I hope this is the one where you make a good speech. We screwed up. We conned you, robbed you, killed your baby. We can't take back what we've done. But we want to make it right. Uh, Quill. You murdered the Dragon Lord of Kakarantara! Ah! the two of us together. Lord Foom. The final harvest begins. Dead worlds screaming across space. We must go. Now. Someone needs to take a stand against the church. We could really use some help. You pay one debt, then create another? No, though I can kind of see... Enough. The... I will gather my forces. All right, let's go. 